I think it just all came in one go. Like it's not often you get to enjoy a moment um, knowing that you've won the, the game. And I guess to be able to look around, see the atmosphere, just the, the smiles on the girls' faces when all of a sudden it clicked in. Um, and obviously just being on the bench with everyone. Um, yeah, it just, it still doesn't feel real just yet. Um, because we've been working for this for so long and to have childhood dreams come true, like it's just, it's just amazing. To be able to fill the trophy cabinet one is a, a milestone in itself because international netball is at its absolute peak. It is so ferocious and tough out there. And I think to have sustained success, to be able to back up and go again and go again under all kinds of conditions. So that in itself is, is a challenge. You build trust and confidence in decision making when you've got great people around you. Our high performance staff leave no stone unturned. The greatest confidence I get as a coach is the effort and the intent that the girls have had across the, this entire build. When you are selected, you are selected to play. There is not a rookie um, opportunity at a World Cup. You've been picked with a skill set that we will need out on court and we needed all 12 players across that um, that final to get to the World Cup um, grand final. Whilst I probably, um, I guess, brought a, a vision in first, they're the ones that, that evolve it. You've got all these great individuals that come together, but it had to be about uh, the we um, and you know we've focused on us for a long time and I think that's where the strength has come is we focused on us and backed in and evolved a game plan that yeah that um, accentuated their skill sets. They know that um, it's bigger than them, um, bigger than us and everything that we do um, can actually have an influence on others so to be a part of something that can be um, so broad is is pretty inspiring.